Don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel. One day, when I was around age 19, a friend visited my home and met my absence. While returning, I met him on the way and he asked, Where have you been? And I answered, I went to think. Surprised, my friend asked, You went to think? I think he had never heard of anyone going to think all his life. Just because everyone thinks they are thinking simply because they have a brain. In today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you the little mistakes most people make which makes them poor. If you're new here, consider subscribing so you won't miss other interesting videos like this. Now here's the thing. One of the simple and common mistakes most people make in life is to leave their life always inside the noise which doesn't allow them to think and be creative. When I mention noise here, it doesn't have to be an audible noise. Your place of work is noisy. The meeting with friends is noisy. Facebook is noisy. And Instagram is noisy. While all these things are good, you won't be creative if you don't set time aside to be alone without any distraction. You see, we all have a brain that is so powerful and creative. Your brain can lead you to wealth if you use it to think. But thinking takes a lot of discipline. Henry Ford said, Thinking is the hardest work therein and that's why only a few people do it. You've been told several times that you have the capacity to change your own life. But how exactly is that possible? Well, you won't change your life by using your hands more often. Your legs don't have the power to change your life and your eyes can't do it. The only thing you can use to change your life is your brain. It's your brain that will give you an idea. It's your brain that thinks. It's your mind that believes and it's your brain that creates solutions. It's all about your brain. But again, your brain can't work effectively in a noisy environment. You can't ever become a success at anything or in life except you're very creative. It takes creativity to see what others are not seeing. It takes creativity to do what others think is impossible. It takes creativity to create a product, a service, a movement or anything meaningful. Unfortunately, noise is the enemy of creativity. One of the disciplines you need to have is the ability to excuse the noisy world because noise is the enemy of creativity. Unfortunately, most people live their life right inside and always with noise. When I said noise, it doesn't really have to be physical, audible noise. The silent noise while a few audible noises are all around us, most of the noise in the world is what I call silent noise. When you visit Facebook, everything there is a noise. But it's silent. When you go to a news site, everything there is noise. But it's silent. When we hang around our friends, most of the times, that's noisy. When we go to school or work, yes, that's a very noisy environment. But they are often silent noise. While some of this noise is good, we won't be creative or successful if we don't know how to often separate ourselves from them because without a separation from noise, our brain cannot function or be creative. Without creativity, we can't achieve success in life. Living in the world and leaving the world Anyone who wants to be rich and successful have to do two things very well. You have to live in the world and understand the world and you have to also leave the world to create what the world needs. In other words, there should be a time you take leave from the world. There should be times you log out of social media. There should be times your phone is on silent. There should be times you are at home but the TV is switched off. There should be a time you are with nobody and no internet connections. There should be a time you are with yourself alone. This is the time you have for reflection. This is the time you have to see the world from a different perspective. This is the time you have to think and reassess situations. This is the time you can task your brain to think and create a solution to a major problem. The problem is that most people almost never have such a time. The Horror of the Busy World The modern world is a busy clumsy world. Millions of people all over the world wake up with the alarm clock because they must not get late for their jobs. 
It's always a busy day at work and the only time you have at night can only be used for some entertainment. This deadly routine continues forever and this is one of the reasons for the world's poverty. Remember my personal story at the beginning of this video? As a young guy, I would always go to a lonely place to think. I think and write whatever ideas come to my mind. These days, I no longer go to a thinking room as often but I've created for myself an environment that's void of noise. First, I detest audible noise with all my life. I can never leave or stay for a long time in a place that's audibly noisy. Aside from the audible noise, I try to live far from the other silent noise. I have never bought a TV in my entire life. I'm not on Facebook, Instagram or anything like that because I free up my mind from this silent noise. I have a clear mind to think and be creative. Don't take Henry Ford's words lightly. Henry Ford was a great man. He did for the world what most of us can only dream of. But Ford has a secret. He thinks when others don't. Henry Ford said, thinking is the hardest work therein and I need you to take that statement very seriously. Don't ever believe that because you have a brain, you are thinking. Thinking is a conscious effort and it's better done when you're free from the noisy distractions of the world around you. You can't think while chatting with a friend on social media. You can't think when watching the TV. You can't think while working a job. While all of the above is a good thing to do, you must be disciplined enough to create for yourself an environment that encourages your brain to work properly. Having a social media free day isn't going to be a bad thing once in a week. Switching off the TV a few days every month isn't going to be a bad idea. Making it a rule never to leave close to audible noise is a good idea. The food for thought. This video will not be complete if you don't talk about the food for thought. You won't just think simply because you have a brain. The quality of your thought will be determined by the quality of what you feed your mind. Show me any creative or successful person who doesn't read good books. Every truly successful person read books and the reason for that is because your mind can't process great things except you feed it with a great idea. It's so unfortunate that we are living in a world where the school has stolen education from most people. School has made so many people illiterate because when people finish school, they think that they are educated. Then they stop learning. When last did you read a book? When last did you listen to educative materials? When last did you learn new things? Learning is very important because the quality of your thinking is determined by the quality of what you know and read. Listening to educative materials are the ways to learn new ideas. In summary, if you really want to be successful in life, you need to be smart and creative. To be smart and creative, you need to hate noise both audible and silent noise. Feed your mind with quality materials and avoid noise. Spend time with yourself. Walk alone in a lone place. Meditate and spend time to read. If you use your brain God has given you effectively, you may achieve far more things than most people in the world.